What is up, amazing, beautiful people here? Boy, Jeffrey Gamer back at you with another GTA 5 eh, LSPDFR tutorial. And today, guys and gals, we're going to be doing a little cosmetic uh, uh, mod to our map. We're going to be doing a map mod. And this was sent to me by my boy, our boy, the Mexican. Much love to my mi hermano grande. Today, we are going to be changing Life Invader into like a Facebook headquarters okay we're gonna be doing a, a a facelift to life invader we're gonna put some realism into our game having a facebook headquarters installed in our game may not be for everybody but I'm sure there's a lot of you out there that might want to put this in your game and this is exactly how we do it let's get started go ahead and click the link down below that says quote unquote social network building for legal purposes that's gonna bring you to this page right here. A big shout out to Israel SR or Israel Zar. Israel Zar. All right, so what you're gonna do, you're gonna hit that download button right there and click that green download button. And because it's just textures, it should download, yeah, really, really quick. Go, and we are going to close. Now, let's minimize this because we may, you never know, we may have to, we may have to come back to it. So, uh, cause they do have some instructions in here, so. Uh, we are going to, well, let's see what that note is. Can use open all interiors. Okay. Yes, yeah, so open all interiors um, is something else that you want to install. Actually, I don't think you need it for the Life Invader building. I believe you can walk into that building regardless. But, um, yeah. So, here's what we are going to do. We're going to need open IV, folks. So, start up your open IV. And mine is going to automatically start... In edit mode, thanks to our boy Criminal Jack, who uh, taught me, and I will continue to teach you uh, on how to always have your Open IV start up in edit mode automatically. Go to Tools, go to Options, right down here in Default Work Mode. Yours might say Read Only. Click Edit. That close. That way, every time when you open up your Open IV, you are automatically in edit mode. All right. With that being said, let's go, folks. The authors, the devs, the people that put in the long hours to create these mods love it. When you click this link right here, we're going to click that install text right there. Whoops. There we go. And this is, this is just, this is what we're going to do y'all. Okay. We're going to start with the, with the first step, first step. I'm telling you, if you follow these carefully, you read it, it will never fail. Um, but I do recommend that you make a copy of your mods folder. You can right click, uh, Actually, you can just take your mods folder and drag it right to your desktop and copy it. That way, if this mod doesn't work, you can just pop that mods folder right back in here and it'll be like you never even installed this, okay? Um, so, here's what we're gonna do. Installation, open up your open IV. Done, do it, all right? Uh, you're gonna, this is the pathway we're gonna go to, time 64 L, y'all. So if we click mods, Right, and then I'm gonna see time 64L right here. If you don't see it right here, it's gonna be over here, okay? And once you click it, you're gonna see a red box pop up and it's gonna ask you if you wanna put it in your mods folder. Click yes, click show in mods folder, okay? So once you do that, mods, time 64L, double click that. Now we're gonna do levels, GTA 5. You can see right there, city underscore city W, underscore city W. We want Beverly 01, Beverly 01, and BH1 underscore 06 dot RPF. Okay, it's all alphabetized numerical order. It's gonna be right here, BH1 underscore 06 dot RPF. All right, so we're gonna double click that. Now, right up here, uh, X tier. Look at this, they actually have the backups for it. Look at that. Okay, so listen, y'all. Listen, listen. Uh, you can either do the mods folder trick that I just taught you, that I just teach you, I just showed you, um, or you can just follow this exact tutorial, but do it with the backup folder there. So that's pretty cool. I love it when they add those. Um, so this is going to be for the exterior. We are where we got to be for this exterior. This first pathway that we just followed is going to replace the exterior. So in the WinRAR, Let's double click that exterior folder. And these are all the files right here. Let's highlight all eight of these files. 
drag them anywhere's right here and just make sure nothing's highlighted okay just bring them right here drop them in that's it all right we're gonna go back in our winrar now we got to do the interior now if we scroll down in the readme you can see interior right there okay here's a new pathway so let's double click our mods folder bring us back to the beginning and this is telling us we got to go to time 64 h same thing y'all if you don't see it over here click it over here and click show mods folder all right so time 64 h levels gta5 interiors and then we want this v underscore int underscore nine v underscore int underscore nine right there double click that okay now we are going to open up the interior folder in the winrar okay and we're going to highlight all of these make sure you're not highlighting the folder you're only highlighting the papers the the v9 couch uh desk facebook office okay two four six eight ten twelve thirteen files there should be you're going to left click them drag them drop them in just like that all right we're going to hit back one more time and double click this monitor folder all right there's only one file for that okay but we have a different pathway so again double click that mods folder and we want time 64 h levels gta 5 uh this time we want props last time we went to the interiors we want props then we want residential and then we want v electrical dot rpf v electrical dot rpf double click that all right simple in your winrar that prop monitor left click drag it drop it right in there all right so now if we go back we have our monitor interior exterior all set now if we go to backup and here we go we have our interior okay there's that there's the monitor one so it's got the monitor folder, the interior folder, and the exterior stuff right there. So if you want to replace everything back, that's all you got to do, folks. Follow this exact tutorial, these exact pathways that I just showed you, and drop in these files that are in the backup folder. Absolutely love it when they do that. That's absolutely awesome. Um, okay, so we're all set with the README. We are all set with the WinRAR. Click your edit mode. We can exit out of that. Folks, let's hop into the game and let's check out our new Facebook build. I'll see y'all in there. All right, everybody. So here we are in front of our brand new Facebook building. Check this out. Let's check this out. I think this is it's pretty cool, y'all. It's pretty cool. Um, it's got the logo up top. It's got the... Uh, the signage on the side of the building there. Let's shoot inside the building and see what we got going on. They got a Facebook uh, entrance rug right there. Pop up in here. This is this is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. I'm digging this yoga zone. All these colors are changed. Everything has changed as far as the colors. Um. Now there should be, look at that. You can see the Facebook logos that we just saw outside. They're right there on the window. So cool. Facebook, Facebook, look at that. I kind of dig this. Um, files right there. Keep calm and carry on sharing. So it's got a few little cues here and there. There's the monitor that we replaced. Uh, so that is the Facebook monitor. Super cool. Duper duper cool, y'all. All right. And there is just, you know, more Facebook logos. So, I mean, that's that's really what it is. That's really bright because, uh, you know what? Let me, uh, let me go ahead and put active on top. It's probably because I have... Yeah, look at all this stuff I got. <laughs> probably because the HDR. No levels no why is that so bright colorfulness 
That's probably a, a mixture of of all of it. So if I turned it all off, it probably won't be that bright, right? Yeah, there we go. But that's, look at the difference without the, all the reshade on. It still looks good. But once you start putting in this reshade stuff, look, it's a bit, I know it's a bit dark for some people's taste, but I love it. All right, so um, let's get out of there. That is going to be it, ladies and gentlemen. Big shout out to the Mexican lovey bro. Thank you for always, man. Mexicans always shooting me uh, new mods and that to try out. So thank you so much for this one, brother. Um, big, big shout out to the Mexican. Uh, he is linked down below. So please go check my boy out. And, uh, you know, he, he goes on his channel from time to time. A lot of people think he's inactive, but he's not. My man is not inactive. He goes on his channel. And uh, regardless, got to go show the man some respect. He's an amazing dude. Um, that is going to be it. Until next time, everybody, be safe, be healthy, be positive. Follow the rules and obey the law. Your boy, Jeffy Gamer, is out. Later, y'all.